Riley Heikelby. Today's story is Pip the Little Penguin by Roger Pretty. Pip the Little Penguin. Pip is black and Pip is white. Just a regular penguin, dark and light. But Pip does not like black and white. He feels so dull, he wants to be bright. Then, one day, Pip looked up at a light-filled sky. He looked at his dad and he asked him why. If there is red and green and blue, can't little penguins be colorful too? I want to be blue, just like a whale. A big blue whale with a big blue tail. Pip, you're not big and you're just not blue. You're black and white and quite small, too. Then I want to be green like a crocodile. A crocodile with a snappy smile. But penguins are not crocodiles. You're black and white and you walk for miles. Then can I be red just like a fox with a bushy tail and four black socks? No, you're not red or sly or cunning. You're black and white and not made for running. And I want to be orange like an orangutan in a jungle gang. An orangutan in a jungle gang. But a penguin can't live high in a tree. You're black and white and you miss the sea. Can I be purple like a butterfly and fly with the birds up in the sky? Penguins can't fly to and fro. You're black and white and you slide on snow. Then I'm going to be pink, just like a pig with a curly tail and a belly so big. But you're not pink and you don't like muck. You're black and white with feet like a duck. Can I be brown like a fearsome bear, a grizzly bear with a grizzly stare? Pip, you're black and white with a lovable stare and about as fierce as a teddy bear. Then I'm going to be yellow like a big proud lion, a lion that's brave and as strong as iron. But Pip, you're not a yellow cat. You're a black and white penguin, that is that. Look, says Dad, it's Skunk and Zebra, Panda too. They're black and white, just like you. What's so wrong with black and white? We think black and white's all right. So at last, little Pip has learned to see that being yourself is the way to be. The end. Pip the Little Penguin. By Roger Purdy. Alright, Riley, alright, Kobe. Hope you guys enjoyed the story. Love you. Bye.